Today is your last chance to register to vote. Early voting kicks off for the November 6th general election tomorrow. Voters can head to the Vigo County Annex to cast absentee ballots beginning tomorrow. And that's where we find News 10's Abby Kirk. She joins us now live to walk us through what you need to know before heading out to the polls. Patrice, this Vigo County annex site is just off Oak Street here in Terre Haute. This is the only site that will be open tomorrow, Wednesday, for early voting from 8 a.m. until 4 p.m. The voice to be heard, I guess. More than 80 residents registered just outside the courthouse Tuesday. That's as registration wraps up at midnight. I think it's so important. Um, you can't have a say if you. You don't. Indiana voters may begin casting their ballots Wednesday in early voting in the November 6th general election. Katie Collins says election day can be a headache for some. When you put it off to the last minute on election day, the lines are so much longer. Sometimes your employers, you know, they. It's hard for them to let you have the time to go. State election leaders say early voting can be done through a mail in absentee ballot or in person at a voting center such as the annex off of Oak Street in Terre Haute. Make note though, if you mail in an absentee ballot, it must be postmarked by November 5th to be counted. These are the people that are our relatives, our neighbors. They're the people we've grown up with that they've taken an interest and they need our support because they're the ones that are willing to change it for us. Most are encouraging others that this election matters and your voice counts. Get your opinion out. It might not be the same as mine, but at least we'll have, we'll figure out, we'll come together as a community and figure this out. And the voter registration office has made it quite simple for you to find these early voting sites. Now, just a reminder, this Vigo County annex site is the only one that is open tomorrow, Wednesday, for early voting. More sites will be added throughout the month. Those we have linked on our website at WTHITV.com. For now, live reporting in Terre Haute, Abby Kirk, News 10, back to you.